Hi, Starship. Oh, hey guys, how you doing? It's Chris. Uh, as you can see, I'm a little bit more relaxed because it's a casual video. It's basically going to be an update slash change video for the Mr. Ramon 420 channel. No reviews today, but you can watch my most recent review for Trust right here. Check it out. It's, it's really good. Also, leave a link down below in case you're not up for checking it right now. You can check it later with the link and, and, and all that good stuff. So, yeah, as I said, uh, it's the slash update. It's the update slash change video because it's something I've been wanting to do for a long time. Uh, I'm going to get one of the things out of the way because I know a few of you fans, which is weird to say, have asked me for a long time, Chris, what the fuck happened? Um, you were doing a lot of reviews for a very long time, and then over the past two years, you kind of slowed down and you stopped. Hell, this year, I only did maybe four or five videos for this channel. Not Probably not even that. A um, couple things occurred. One, as you can see, I moved. Had to get out of the place where I was living for almost seven years. Uh, it's going to be seven in, in March, so technically six and a half years right now. The whole situation became a problem over there because you're living right next door to a drug dealer whose best friends are crackheads, cokeheads, uh, people on angst, people on gas salts, people enjoying ecstasy, and weed. Weed, I'm cool with. I'll even X. You know, you. I'm not going to say do that, but I got no problem with that. It's the other few that I have a problem with, especially when some asshole is knocking at your door at 3 a.m. And all I hear is, ah, my skin's on fire. The clouds are yelling at me. Why can't I talk to the squirrels? Ah! And you're running down the street naked, and that becomes weird. Oh, and the sex offenders that live near you, the six or seven, maybe ten, that live in the block and a half radius of my place. So. Yay! Now, aside from the living situation, there's also the school situation. Now, a few of you are friends with me on Facebook. So, you know, since 2013, I've been going to school to basically try to get a degree under the Information Technology Management field under the business program. Uh, that's a whole different story. But complications came up from time to time, basically because of my body. Uh, my body's a train wreck. There's just so many fucking problems. I mean, I can go into detail about what happened to me in 2010, but if you're fans of, fans of mine, or if you saw my first video ever, it basically shit tells you what happened to me as to why I got onto YouTube. But there's been so many other problems. I mean, there's been uh, cellulitis infection, uh, bust of the leg, uh, damaged body, uh, shifted left kidney and colon from the front to the back. Yeah, the, the organs, they all, they moved all the way to the back of the screen. And of course, the, um, the, the tumor on the spine, which was benign, but <laughs> that was something to holler that day. Uh, so, those were complications that became situation where you go through all this and you just don't care by the way. You don't have the energy to. And so, and so another reason why I've been doing videos anymore, as many well as much as I used to. Um, I'll be honest with you. I uh, suffer from depression. Uh, bi bipolar status. I guess that's what you call it. I don't know what you say. Uh, it's been with me for as long as I can remember. Uh, it's always been pretty bad. Times have been able to hide it, but it's that you know you put on 
a smile for the world and how even doing videos on here at times where I just wanted to you know crawl into a hole or get into my bedroom and just cover a little blank because you you don't want to be involved in the world it becomes uh, just too much uh, so you have those wonderful thoughts that you really shouldn't have um, just don't want to do, do anymore but what helps is counseling and the right amount of medication that be able to balance with your system just so that you don't you know fucking lose it and when I say lose I mean just just become broken and just crouch in a hole or corner or something and, and you know guys I'm I'm sorry I didn't mean to bring this, but just I feel like I need to be honest or something. I mean, I'm sorry for making you guys depressed. And I, I really, I shouldn't be doing that. Shouldn't, especially unless it, that's not fair to you guys. You know what? For that, I'm going to, here's a picture of a pie. A lovely day. The final thing that kind of kept me away and not made me do as many videos as I used to on YouTube is YouTube itself. Uh, the ability to say, no, you're not going to be able to show your video because there's 20 seconds of a shitty old song that is on your channel or there's a clip of a movie that you, you can't show for at, at all, for like 10 or 5 or 15 seconds. It's um, and just after so many times, like I think 10 of my videos were blocked from at least 20 or 30 different countries because they didn't have the right music or, you know, the, the clip that was being shown was like, mm, it's, it's wrong, not wrong as in sick and fucked up. It's wrong because it's a movie. And it would have been nice to be able to do that for people to see but that didn't happen so that's one of the changes I'm going to be making on, on the Ramon 420 page uh, as of right now uh, my old patch time videos are going to be going over to Facebook that's right I'm doing Facebook exclusive content for that because uh, honestly I'm going to be able to do my dances and and the music me doing wacky waving and just other weird shit just go along with it because I miss being able to do that. I know some of you guys miss it too. Uh, so that's going to that's gonna change. Uh, also, interaction with you guys. I have been really shitty to do that. Whether it's guys had a message for me, let me know what's going on, or you know, you want to ask about a, a movie that I recommended, or say you're a director or producer that wanted me to take a look at you film and I didn't really get back to you. Uh, one of the things was I kind of get sick and tired of telling a few people that you know even if I'm going to review your film they may not like it but you want me to give it a thumbs up I can't do that. One that's just bullshit. Two that's like fuck you. You want you want criticism or you, you actually want me to say Oh, this is the best fucking film. No, I'm not going to. If I enjoyed it, I enjoyed it. If I didn't, I mean, you're going to get a reason. Hell, you, it might be so bad. I might put it on the piece of shit theater, which that's actually coming back. Um, and I got a target I, I have. Oh, vicious. Um, also, different genres. I'm doing, I'm going to be doing different genres. Uh, martial arts, old school, maybe uh, ones with music here and there, because that's how I, how I roll. Uh, so it's not going to always be sick and fucking nasty. It, that, it's always going to be there if it goes underground. But it's just ones I want to, ones I like to talk about as well. And finally, live chats. I'm actually going to be doing them. Uh, 
That way you guys can talk to me about what, what's ever going on and maybe have an answer for you here and there. Because I remember years ago when I did the Q&A and they were weird as fuck. And I loved it because it was, they were fucking disturbing because I told you guys, you can ask me anything. And you guys asked me. Wow. Just, so I'm going to bring that back. I don't know if I'm going to do it on here or on Facebook. You're going to have to let me know uh, to what I, I should do. Uh, but that's all for right now. I'm going to give you a link to my Facebook page. That way you can contact me and leave me a message. Also, I'm going to give you the link to... Also, I'm going to give you a link to my uh, my Atroc review. That way you can take a look at that. And as well, I'm going to set up a link for my twi uh, Twisted Shit review list. Those are These are basically all the movies that I have reviewed for the good part, ones that didn't get deleted from Facebook, from YouTube. Uh, that way you can see if there's something that I, you don't know if I talked about, you can take a look through the list and you can find out. Guys, I appreciate the time you took out of your busy schedule to look at my video and listen to what I have to say. You're fucking awesome. I love you all. Um, oh, and if you have friends that are interested in interesting people talking about strange films, and especially a dude that looks like a mailman from Seinfeld or a scientist that let all the dinosaurs loose in Jurassic Park. Tell them all around. Uh, until next time, rate, comment, subscribe, and don't drink the Kool-Aid. Later. Just get on down and hit me. That so fucking hit me.